pizza is actually nice. TikTok is bad for your mental health. People drink pink gin because it's trendy. The earth is flat. I'll be switching the positions for you. Picking in the kitchen. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel as you guys have seen by the title of today's video today i will be reacting to your guys's unpopular opinions because i did ask you guys on instagram to send me over some of your unpopular opinions and oh my god i did get quite a lot of them so i will be reacting to them all in today's video i'm very excited about it as a few of them are very like the controversial um which isn't Oh, it's a bad thing so I'm very excited to head over this video but before we get into this video please make sure to leave a thumbs up I would love to get to 30 likes on this video if you guys could all go and leave a thumbs up on this video it would really help me out and make sure to leave a comment on this video if you are enjoying it so far and also subscribe if you are a new person who is watching the video but without further ado let's go to the video I just want to address my hairstyle because I used the Beauty Works hair waver this morning and I literally looked like Hagrid. Like it was so big and wavy and like all over the place. So yeah, um, I'm trying to keep my hair under control. So do not judge me for having a kind of big wavy hair. But to be honest, I'm kind of feeling it now. So I think I'm going to have my hair like us more often and let's head over with the unpopular opinions right first one is the driver's license is overrated personally no like i think it's a really good song to listen to in the car especially when i'm in the car the booth's got as well um yeah that's how i kind of song in the car at the minute but no um i don't think it's overrated at all i really like the song oh my god it's gone so dark, what the hell. I've always liked it and I know it isn't as popular as it used to be now, but I still love it so much. Chicken is disgusting. How dare you say that? Like, chicken is my favourite meat. Like, how can anyone find it disgusting? I think majority of people love chicken. If they ever got rid of it, or ever had a shortage of chickens I would be distraught how is chicken disgusting like explain to me hello like no it's not like it's so nice what are you thinking like are you okay do you need some help pineapple on pizza is actually nice I'm kind of like indecisive about this one to be honest because I'm not the biggest fan of pineapple I'm not gonna lie I'm never I've had pineapple on, on pizza before. I've kind of enjoyed it, but kind of not. It's kind of like a biting into like a juicy sack on a pizza. Uh, sounds disgusting, I know. So, I kind of agree with you, but kind of not. I'm kind of like in the middle of that one. TikTok is bad for your mental health. Oh my God, yes, it is. Do not even get me started. TikTok is so damaging for your mental health like I remember when I used to have 5,000 followers on mine and um, I have deleted it now by the way but um I used to post the TikToks all the time I'm not gonna lie a few of them were embarrassing but yeah um I think a few of them got 200,000 views or something and oh my god the amount of hate comments I got was absolutely disgusting like yeah, and like a lot of them, are, a lot of them are fake accounts anyway, and they were giving you hate. But yeah, like the TikTok is very damaging for your mental health. I know that a lot of other social medias are as well, but I don't know why it is. But TikTok is the absolute worst for it, and it's absolutely awful. So I do have to agree with you on that one. And if you ever get any hate online, the best thing to do is ignore them and block them because they are not worth your time. I've had so much hate on my YouTube, Instagram, but all I have to do is block it out and then, yeah, and you'll move on. It's as simple as that. If people drink pink gin because it's trendy, I have to disagree with you on that one. I actually used to love the drinking pink gin before I was drunk of it and I spewed it all up and I can never drink it ever again, but 
before that, I used to love it. I used to love the kind of like the pinky berry flavour to it. And pink gin, the with lemonade was always nice. But now, even the smell of pink gin makes me feel sick. Like, I can't anymore. Like, oh, no, no, no. And I guess a few people they would only drink it because they're mates drinking it. But I think a lot of younger people they do like the gins now. Especially flavoured gins. The Scorsons have brought out orange ones, peach ones, lemon, um, all sorts of other flavours as well. So, but I think like a pink gin is probably more of a younger person's drink, I think, anyway. The next one is cold plate are overrated. I have to agree with you on that one. Like, yeah, a few of the songs are catchy, but I just find them like like, what's the word? Like, the songs aren't even that good, really. Like, I don't know what it is, but even my dad says this as well. He says that Coldplay are overrated, and, I'd, yeah, I do agree with him. Like, I'm sure a lot of people think that as well, but I think it is the type of music that they make as well, and, like, it's just not good, really. I'm sorry if I offended any of you, but this is just in my opinion, so, yeah. Dark chocolate over milk chocolate, nah ha ha, no. Milk chocolate over dark chocolate. And to be fair, I like both of them, but if I had to choose out of dark and milk, of course, 110%, I would go for milk chocolate. Like, anyone who chooses dark or, or even white over milk chocolate is not right in the head. I'm very sorry, but it's the truth, like, if you can't handle the truth, then click off this video. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm definitely a milk chocolate type of person, and it definitely has to be milk or dark any day. Like, yeah. Pugs are ugly, not cute. To be honest, I do have to agree with you on that. I'm French Bulldog as well. I'm probably going to get a lot of hate for saying French Bulldogs, as I know that they are very trendy, but... Uh, do you know uh, and like how how many breathing problems the pugs and Frenchies have? Like it's actually awful. It's a little screwed up faces. I've never really liked them really. Like yeah, I'm sure there will be some cute ones out there, but I think the majority of them are quite ugly. So I'm sorry if I have offended any of you guys, and I'm sure I have not hurt any of your Frenchies or pugs' feelings. But yeah. I do have to agree with this unpopular opinion. Harry Potter is crap. Yeah, I would say so. Every time I've watched Harry Potter, I've never overall enjoyed it really. But I do, it looks like Hagrid today guys, by the way. Hagrid hair. <laughs> yeah, but um, Harry Potter, yeah, yeah. I've never really been a big fan of Harry Potter, I'm not going to lie. I think people go through stages where they'll be obsessed with Harry Potter and then they'll, come, and then they'll kind of move on and realise that it isn't that good. <laughs> yeah. Harry Potter is a no from me. Uh, people only go to the gym to wear fancy gym gear. I do kind of agree with you on that one because I would never go to the gym because, like, a lot of the gym stuff is so expensive. Especially if you go to, like, the Bowen Tea or Gymshark or wherever else you get your gym stuff from. But, yeah, um, and you always see girls posing the fancy, like, the gym sets on, matching pink or blue, like, sets and everything. And I'm sure, uh, girls especially, I'm, I'm men, but I think we'll try and get a fancy gym outfits to try and impress people there as well but yeah um i do kind of agree with you on that one and i would never go to the gym only because i would feel so like self-conscious about going really um and also there would be like all these people wearing their fancy gym sets and stuff and it's just like no <laughs> no thank you the earth is flat don't really agree with you on that one. I'm sorry, but no, like, I don't see how the earth can be flat when, like, there's photos 
of the earth and other planets and they are like circles so yeah I don't really understand but I do understand why people may think that because you could drop like you could go on a plane and you wouldn't feel as if you go around in a circle if you know what I mean um, but no the earth is not flat hot noodles are disgusting no like I like to have a pot noodle here and there. I probably only have them once a month if that. But pot noodles are very handy for like convenience. Um, but like I do understand why people may find them they're kind of disgusting because it's basically just like dry noodles and you put some water in them. And it isn't very nutritional either. So I do understand why people say that. But they're very handy for convenience and do taste very good in my opinion weddings are a waste of time mm. more like a waste of money <laughs> like yeah I suppose if a couple got married and then they got divorced a few years later it kind of would be a waste of time but I also feel as if they can be a waste of money especially if you're spending thousands on a wedding for one day for me personally I think I would rather have like a smaller wedding and and save the money to go towards like a house or like or better things if you know what I mean. I suppose the weddings could be like a waste of time if you hardly know the person maybe or like you know that the couple aren't right for each other but it is a nice event to go to um, when you get yourself all dressed up and everything you know and do your hair and makeup and they wear a lovely little dress or a suit or something but it all depends if the couple are going to last really isn't it I suppose the YouTubers make less money than what they make out to make I would say that a lot of YouTubers will be very honest with the audience and will say I do earn quite a lot of money from YouTube but I think there will be a few YouTubers probably more smaller ones as well the way will say, oh, I like, I make £100 per video. And then you clearly know that you probably only make, like, £5 if that, you know what I mean? But, yeah, um, I suppose a few YouTubers, they will try to brag about how they make a lot of money. I probably don't even make half of what they're making out to make. But I think a lot of YouTubers, I think a lot of YouTubers are, are very honest. I'm very grateful as well. Wine is disgusting. No, I... I love a glass of rosé wine. I like a glass of white wine as well, but red wine? No, thank you. I hate it. Um, so, like, I do understand why people hate the wine, as it does have a bit more of an alcoholic -y taste to it. I love a bit of rosé, a lemonade, they mix together, especially if I'm out in the sun or something. But yeah, um, I understand why people hate the red wine because, oh, no, it's like, oh, it's horrible. Like, uh, no. Behind her eyes is rubbish. If you don't know what behind her eyes is, basically, it's a Netflix series. Um, and I did actually watch it with Scott, and I actually found it very repetitive because I felt as if it was going around in circles a little bit. So I do understand why people are saying it is rubbish, but I suppose everyone has like a different taste in like. A Netflix series and what they want to watch and stuff but when I watched it I did find it a bit repetitive and yeah a bit boring as well I think Friends is so overrated oh my god 100% I do not understand why people who want to watch it like to be honest I'm not really a fan of watching a lot of American series I don't know why. A lot of people say this as well. I think it is a very popular, unpopular opinion. But yeah, um, I totally agree with you on that. Like, yeah, it is very, very, very overrated. Yeah. The final unpopular opinion is pasta is vile. How the hell could you even say that? I absolutely love pasta so much. I could have it with every meal if I wanted to. Like, oh my god, I love pasta. Like. Pasta with gravy, pasta with like cheese, pasta with like other sauces, like you can have it with anything, like it just tastes so good. So, 
if you're saying that pasta is for you, then you need to sort your taste buds out and start liking pasta because pasta is the best thing out there. Like, I love it. Like, yeah, it's so good. Alright? <laughs> okay, but here is the end of my unpopular opinions video. I really hope that you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, make sure to leave a thumbs up, comment down below and also subscribe if you are new because I would absolutely, absolutely, alright, I hear you everybody, I would love to get to 4,000 subscribers by the end of April. So if you all please could subscribe because I have been wanting to hit 4,000 subscribers since my birthday which was in October and we're now in March so come on everybody where are you please subscribe and I think I have 100,000 impressions on my channel and only 3,000 odd people are subscribed so come on everybody please subscribe but anyway I really hope that you guys have enjoyed and I'll see you all in my next video